So husband, kids, and we have a house now. So it's pretty busy, pretty hectic um, on top of working full time as well. Typical day for me starts extremely early, sometimes 4.30 or 5. Go to work there till about 5 o'clock, um, come home, dinner, um, do homework with my son, get them ready for bed. Everyone's down by eight, I'm passed out by nine, so, and then it just starts all over again. One of the biggest problems with trying to lose weight is that um, it kind of becomes like this rat race of, of trying to help yourself, you try something different, and it just, it doesn't work, so you revert back to what you were doing before. Then you look for the next big thing, you know, that everybody's talking about, and you sign up for that. You just see that the weight continues to pile on and pile on. If you're, you know, a full-time mom and you work full-time as well, sometimes you can't come home and cook because, you know, the kids are at you, your husband's at you, everything needs to be done. So we're always trying to find that quick fix. So definitely um, with changing my lifestyle and the way I eat, um, finding all other alternatives besides the quick fix for food um, has been challenging for me. For me, the most important thing is is definitely sustainable because I've already been in the the retired cycle of, of things not working and trying this and it's not working. I'm back where I started from. So definitely something that I can maintain through my life. I don't have to constantly start over from square one or reinvent the wheel all over, like, over again to um, get to my weight loss goal or to maintain my weight loss goal. I think that's one of the most important things too is to maintain it. There's a stigma that goes, to, goes along with it if, that if we ask for help then we're weak. Um, but I don't think so. I think it takes courage to ask for help. I think it takes courage to reach out for that, that extra help, that, that, that lifeline. And having I remove be that extra help for me um, has been amazing. And I'm not, I'm not catering my life around I remove, but I, I remove fits seamlessly into, into my lifestyle. In shedding these unwanted pounds, it has definitely increased my mood. It's such a change from where I was, getting back to that place of probably who I was before I came home from college. I wanted to be happy again with how I felt in my clothes. If the, if the reward is that my clothes feel better and I feel better in my clothes, I like that.